<laughs> no, you know, see, really, I should have an astrologer do it because I'm I'm right on the cusp. So um, I I think I'm a Scorpio. I'm not Scorpio. sure. Scorpio. Yeah, well, I think so. Well, that means we're going to have an affair. Why? What sign are you? I don't know, but I think it's a very good idea, don't you? Well, except that I'm a happily married woman. Oh well, I won't tell any money if you don't. Hey, you're the one who started this whole thing. What sign would you say I am? Ah. Uh... Leo the politician or Gemini the liar. Is there a difference? <laughs> <laughs> Dry martini on the rocks, Frank. A double olive, a glass of cocktail sherry, and a vodka daiquiri. Nothing to be alarmed about. It's just a little turbulence. Are you all right? Hmm. Well, I'll feel better, I think, when we've landed. Wherever that is. I can get you something to settle your stomach. Well, I don't think it's my stomach. It's more in the area of my soul. Well, let me know if you need anything. I think the turbulence is behind us now. Um, do you know anything about the Quivele Indians? Only what it says in the brochure. Yes, but they're not mentioned in any of the anthropology books. Well, if they're in the brochure, then you'll find them. Another round? Yeah, just don't stop. Huh? How about you girls? Huh? Oh. Ready? Sure you are. There you are. Oh, just look at that smile. Tell me something. How can a beautiful creature like you take pleasure in keeping all these nice people's destination a secret from them? Secrets are fun. Don't you think secrets are fun? Telling them is even more fun. Are you going to tell us yours? Okay. If you're game, I am. Which one would you like to hear first? How about the one about your wife? <laughs> Where did you get an idea like that? See, keeping them is even more fun. Excuse me, could you tell me, is that Johnny Delmonico singing? It sounds like him. It's weird. Yeah. On our way to the airport, we've already died. Yeah, and I've never heard this song before. How long before we leave? How long have you two been married? Three or four hours? Uh, no, four hours and 20 minutes. <laughs> Is it that obvious? <laughs> well, you're the only people on board who haven't asked me where we're going, only how soon we're gonna get there. Ah, uh, Mr. Hunsicker, welcome back to the world. Can I get you a drink? Uh, Can I have yeah. some hot hors d'oeuvres coming up? Yeah, sure, uh, bourbon on the rocks. What do we do, run into some bad weather while I was sacked out? No, we've had a very smooth flight so far. But we should have been in Dallas a half hour ago. Dallas? I don't think you're awake yet, Mr. Hunsicker. This is a special charter flight to the portals of Eden. Portals of Eden? Mm-hmm. What portals of Eden? What are you talking about? Is this some kind of joke? I'm supposed to be on flight 17 to Dallas. You must have your dates mixed up, Mr. Hunsicker. I have you right here on the passenger list. Yeah. Mr. Albert A. Hunziker, Space Age Trucking Company of the Bronx. I never made that reservation. No, space was reserved by Mr. Herman Pratt. Do you know Herman Pratt? Oh, sure, he's my partner, the jerk. Where are we, anyway? They got it painted. What's going on here? Hey, 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 friend. Friend. That's just a sample of how this outfit operates. They thought of everything. Why, they won't even tell us where the place is, where we're going. I mean, what country it's in. Personally, I think it's a fabulous idea. Keeps the tourists away, for one thing. What place? The portals of Eden. Look, we gotta turn this aircraft around. I stand to lose a fortune. Hey, it's not the end of the world. Besides, this could be a ball, boy. Man, I don't need fun and games. Give me that bourbon now.
This place is such a big secret, then how'd you find out about it? 